Hello everyone, it's Faith from Fire Santero. I hope everybody is well. Welcome to my kitchen. Same story, I don't know how many readings you guys... I don't know how many readings you guys watch. Maybe just watch your own, maybe a cross-watch, I don't know. I'm in the kitchen today because at one end of the house, it's just tore up. And at the other end of the house, there's people playing on an Xbox. So, this is where I sit. <laughs> and this is where I do my work. And this is where I read my cards right now, so... Capricorn, it's your turn for July readings. The universe has finally said, throw them down. So that's what I'm doing. I got sage burning. I got what's left over from dinner behind me. I do apologize. I'm not exactly a June cleaver. Seven days a week. Maybe two. Anyway. Mm -hmm. This reading for Capricorn. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your moon rising or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. This can play out whenever. Might play out when you view it. May have already played out. Might play out in the future. I don't know. I'm just throwing down cards. I'm not you. I don't walk in your shoes. You know what's going on with you. Okay. As far as being vice versa, I'm playing out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Cross watchers are welcome here. I encourage it. Just don't read too much into it. Everybody's always welcome at my table, and I appreciate you stopping by. While you're here, if you would like to hit the like button, subscribe button, the notification bell, it helps the channel out, helps it grow. That would be super cool of you if you could do that, if you like what you see. I'm a lot to take in. I'm a great big personality, and I'll be the first person to admit that. All right, Capricorn, before you throw your cards down, two things we need to go over. One, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. This is for entertainment purposes only. And that's my official legal disclaimer. Life-altering decision. What is that exactly? Because if you really break it down, every life decision you make can be life-altering. If it's going to destroy everything that you have built, I highly recommend that you just go inside and figure that out for yourself. But do what you want. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. Two, if it's not your reading, not your story, not your message... If parts of it don't resonate, don't take the whole thing with you. Take what belongs to you, leave the rest behind. If it's not vibing, it's not vibing. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Somebody fell out. Who fell out? Five of Swords. Victory at a cost. Let's we'll see if it comes back out. Maybe some of you are in a victory at a cost situation right now. I don't know. Let's we'll see. The clouds are parting in this picture, though. Looks like there was a bit of a storm. All right. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Capricorn, Sun, and Rising Venus, July 2021. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with us today. Let's bring Capricorn to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Two more. One. I don't like where you cut. Two. Why are you here? Ace of Swords reversed. No communication. Okay. It's going to be another one of them, isn't it? Nothing to say. That's how I'm feeling that. Nothing to say. Okay. What happened? Queen of Pentacles reversed. Somebody got the self-worth sucked out of them. I don't like that. Was it you or was it them? I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Six of Pentacles shortly thereafter. Hard to say when. Energy match, possibly. 
Could have been something came in of equal give and take. I don't know. Again, not my journey. Really? Really? Okay, well, you decided to land funky, so I guess you land how you land and you will be read how you will be read the tower. Speaking of storms. Oof. Is there nothing left to say because the tower has fallen? Or are we still clinging to the walls trying to hold it up? Where are we at, Capricorn? Where are we at with that? You know, there's something to be said about storms. There really is. Some of the worst storms. The brightest rainbows come after them. Gotta hold out for the rainbow. We'll get more into that in a minute. What's coming in? The world. Completion. Old cycles ending, new cycles beginning. Okay. The house just came tumbling down. That perfect time for a new start. Right on. Still being left with the burden? Can't release the burden? Possibly left with things that you need to get off your chest? Well, right now there's nothing to say. So, And again, the cards don't have to play out the way they say they're going to play out. It's all about your journey and what you do with the message. If you choose to do anything at all. What's going on on their side? Nine of Pentacles. Hmm. Oof. Oh, uh, yeah. I can see where Queen of Pentacles reversed would come out of this. Um, she's normally not cocky, but she got it going on. I'm not gonna lie, she's good. She don't need nobody. She's good. Maybe she's made it known that she's good without you. Insert whatever pronoun you want. That's a she. That's what I'm going with right now. King of Swords. Oh, that's a sharp tongue. He's honest. He's honest. Not an emotional guy. Not at all. Sometimes his words can hurt. You know, on the inside, very heavily guarded. Very protective over his emotions tries not to be emotional in the reverse when you get him to that point it's like overflowing with emotion but he's in the upright right now so that's what we're going with I think there was an exchange of words and I think those words hurt I think those words cut and I think those words were a little uh, probably put my Capricorn friends in a place where they didn't feel so good about themselves and that's not a good place for anybody to put you in don't ever let somebody do that to you. Wheel of Fortune reversed. I think that's where the tower started to shake. That's a match of energy. That's a match of energy. Yeah, equal give and take of a different sort. You gonna talk to me like that? Okay, fine. <laughs> you cut me down like that? Okay, fine. Is that what happened? I'm feeling a little squabble coming off of that. We'll get clarifiers on it in a second. Tower, the star. Oh, well. Hmm.
I'm feeling apology. Let me back up a second. If they're good, if they're good without you, or they see that you're good without them. So I'll clarify. That just hit me. Sometimes I just gotta learn to not be so Sagittarian like. No offense to my Sagittarius brothers and sisters. And shut my mouth before I get all the cards on the table. I read them one at a time. Sometimes it gets me in trouble. Gets me in trouble. Just just go with it. This is a card of healing. The star has come in to heal after the falling of the tower. After an exchange of words, after a match of energy that wasn't so, I don't think it was so polite. i put it to you that way. World. Princess of Swords. Nothing left to say. Nothing left to say. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing left to say. I'm hearing, I wish things could have been different. Let's get some clarity, Capricorn. Wow. 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 Universe Source, Spirit and Guides. Can I get some clarity in the cards and support for Capricorn, please? Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, July 2021. Ace of Swords reversed. Why? Talk to me. Nope. Talk to me. Why? Four of Swords reversed. Restless energy. Are you restless? Are you restless, Capricorn? You don't know how to say what needs to be said, do you? You know what needs to be said. I don't think you know how. I'm feeling that's a struggle to be the bigger person. <sighs> Leave it at that. Leave it at that. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles. Nope. Four of Pentacles. Holding it in. This is somebody who don't want to let you go. Shit. One more. Four wands. Because they know they dropped the tower. Four wands reversed. The tower done falling. But they don't want to let you go. They don't know if there's hope to rebuild. Because, you know, the Four of Wands reversed for me is the little minor kind of tower card when it's in the reverse. Yeah. They don't know they can rebuild it. They don't know if there's anything to be salvaged. 
They want to because they don't want to let you go. I think they see that you're doing fine without them. See what happens when I throw some more cards down? Things become clear. It's often first blush, but that's what we clarify. Well, hi. What would you like to say? Ten of Wands upright. Yep. Yep. Burdensome. Let me throw that there. <clears throat> I think you're both a little bit burdened by this. We often get burdened by things that we said, things that should have come out of our mouths differently. You can't turn a clock back. You can't unsay it once it comes out of your mouth. You can't undo it once it's been done. It's not how things work. That's Queen of Pentacles reversed here. Thank you, the sun. <clears throat> Could have happened during a, a season of Leo, not sure when. Could have been a Leo involved. Could just represent a soulmate connection, I don't know. Three wands waiting waiting why the three of wands a lot of fire a lot of fire up in that corner you're probably dealing with a fire sign could be possibly three of wands is an Aries card ten of pentacles hmm Why the King of Swords? Just, this, this just got weird. Hermit. This is where the event started. This is where it all started. Queen of Pentacles in the upright. Oh, shit. That's where it started. Way back when. Argument, hearts, exchange of words. I'm hearing a just you wait till you're going to regret that. And on their side, I'm hearing a, I can't believe I just said that. She was my queen. He was my queen. You know, whatever. But you can't say it once. It, you can't unsay it once it comes out of your mouth. And you can't undo it once it's been done. Why six pentacles here? Nine cups. Oh. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. Little bit too much fun, doing a little bit too much of the things that make you do it feel a little bit too good. Dumping cups, six of swords. Splits the story a little bit. Some of you may have been engaged in a few toxic activities. Some of you were just not happy, so take it however it resonates. Either way, somebody got in a boat and went to the other side of the river. You're done. Energy match. Energy match. Just you wait. You'll see where your ten pentacles were. Just you wait. Just you wait. 
could have had them ten pentacles. Just you wait. What are you? Hanged man. Hanged man reversed on top of that wheel of fortune reversed. Can't turn a clock back once the minutes start ticking. Nope. Can't turn back a clock. You might want to, but you can't. No matter how hung up you get, it is what it is. Once the vibrations go out, there is no going back. Nope. One more on the hangman reverse. Thank you. Knight of Swords reversed. Can't unsay it. Can't undo it. Nothing left to be said. And there the tower fell. And there the tower fell. Why the tower? Why the tower? Seven of Swords reversed. Enlightenment spoken truths. Ten of Cups reversed. One more. shadow side. The devil. The tower has fallen, waiting on a rainbow. Discon disconnecting from this toxic energy. Disconnecting from whatever made you feel not worthy. Those things you say in the heat of a moment can come back and bite you in the ass. Oh, yes, they can. Oh, yes, they can. Sorry, I need coffee. Why the star? High Priestess reversed egos. Egos. Somebody knows that a healing needs to take place. Somebody knows that that healing lies within the star over their head. But somebody's ego got in the way, is getting in the way. One more. One more. One more. Five of swords. Victory to cost. Cross watcher, if you're watching, was it worth it? This seems very petty. Was it worth it? Probably did what was right in the moment. And usually, you know, that, that's a card of, of standing up. No matter what cost you, is the right thing to do. I don't know. I don't know in this case. I don't know. Are you going to stand up and do the right thing? Or are you just going to collect your swords off the beach and walk away? Gonna, yeah, I know this. I know the battle on the beach isn't depicted in this card, but I see that, and that's what I see when I see the Five of Swords. The victory at a cost. A healing needs to take place, and it's not because somebody's ego is getting in the way. Why the world? What? Hi. Take two. Two of wands. Nine of swords in the reverse. 
allowing a cycle to complete, allowing a new cycle to begin, letting go of the wand that is behind you and moving toward the world that is in front of you, Capricorn, putting this out of your head, not letting it keep you up at night anymore, because what has been done has been done. One more. The tower has fallen. Take two. Eight of cups. Three of swords. Your ten cups weren't here. Your ten cups weren't here. Maybe your two cups are over here. Away from this three of swords. Why is the Princess of Swords here? Why the Princess of Swords in reverse? Six of Wands. Capricorn, I have a very funny feeling that whoever you're dealing with, this is like games. Nine of Wands reversed Ace of Wands. Okay. Wow. That's an energy match, let me tell you. Playing games. Throwing in the towel, not striking a match, staying silent on purpose because they want your attention. They want you to reach out first. What? What? You're moving on. You're walking away from this broken heart. And you're taking your nine pentacles with you. You're just like, you could have had it. You didn't want it. I wasn't good enough for you, remember? Wow. Wow. I, I'm not even going to throw one more on that. Why is the ten of wands reversed here? Give me one of this ten of wands reversed, please. Justice. Think, um, yeah. One more. The mud is sort of justice about to drop. Think y'all better just let it be nothing left to say at this point because I think if there's another exchange of words. <laughs> Sword's gonna drop. Scale's gonna balance. You thought there was an energy match before? Oh, hell. Oh, hell. The fool. Off to bigger and better things. Even though you never released the burden. You know you can get your own closure, right? You don't need somebody to do that for you. You're aware of that, right? If it's over in your eyes, it's over in your eyes. If the tower has fallen, let it be on the ground. Let the storm pass. One more. One more. The chariot has landed in the reverse.
do I dare? Why would the chariot be in the reverse? Why would you be pulled in two different directions? Why would you be compelled to revisit this? Why? Now I gotta keep going, really? Yes, I dare throw another card on that. I know this is like gonna be a 40 minute reading. I do apologize, but no, I gotta know. No, I gotta know. Page of Wands. Now they want to talk. Now somebody wants to talk. Do you want to talk? Do you want to revisit this? Do you want to restrike a match? According to this, you're reaching out. You're playing into their game, according to this. Do, do you. Please, by all means, do you. But just be aware. Um, this is sketch. Sketch. Why is the Hierophant reversed here? Strength. Really? Hierophant reversed in strength. Two of Pentacles, still juggling. Still not wanting to commit. Still holding back. Emperor reversed. Still ain't measuring up. You weren't the one that didn't measure up in this scenario. It was them. Super weird. Why? What? Why would you put up with this? Why would you put up with this? For you, I just let the damn tower stay on the ground. Let the storm pass. Let the rainbows come out. Rebuild your tower how you want it built. Where you want it. With your pentacles. Because you good without them. You don't need them. Let's get your advice. Princess of Wands upright. Princess of Cups in the reverse. Wow. I mean, strike the match if you want to, but I'd at least want to know what's in the cup. Because that looks like an empty cup to me. Four pentacles reversed in the sun. If I were you, I'd let this go. Unless that's what the cards are saying. Release it and find your sunshine. Because it's the sunshine comes out at the end of the storm, brings the rainbow. Six of Cups and the Empress. It's okay to feel the nostalgia. You're probably soulmates from like Cadillac seats way back, and that's fine. That's fine. It's cool. But you need to move forward towards your own growth, towards something that's going to grow for you, grow with you. Be the Empress, Capricorn. Wheel of Fortune and the Queen of Wands. Allow the cycle to come to a close because there's better things for you. And you are worthy. And don't you ever forget that. You are the Empress. And you are the queen. And you are worthy of love. And you are worthy of respect. 
Know that you're loved and be blessed, Capricorn. We'll see you next time. Take care, sweetie.